Hello friends, this is Tenders from Fire Emblem Discussion, and I have a big announcement to make. Starting this Friday will be the first ever Fire Emblem Discussion Low Turn Count Tournament. Anyone is welcome to participate. People of all skill levels, of course, are invited. All you need to do is sign up with the Google form you can find in the description of this video. You can also find it on Reddit. I posted it there as well in the Fire Emblem subreddit. Please enter for a chance to win a copy of Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn or to win a $60 gift card to GameStop or the Nintendo eShop. And there will also be second and third place prizes as well. So please stay tuned to hear the rules and the basic setup of the tournament. And I will also answer a couple of frequently asked questions. So first off, the basic tournament setup. There will be four qualifying rounds. Not to make it into the bracket, you will need to compete in one of these qualifying rounds. So please sign up for the time that is most convenient for you. The top 16 players will be taken from each qualifier. Now, I understand this is the first time we've ever done this. If too few people sign up, we will adjust the numbers of qualifying players. After qualifiers, there will be a single elimination bracket. Bracket seating will be based on qualifier results, and the qualifier you participate in will directly correlate with the corner of the bracket you are placed in. This will give everyone an opportunity to play in the time that they are available. Let's move on to the basic rules of the FED LTC tournament. A map must be completed to be considered for advancement in the tournament. Save states may be used to save preps before the map begins for quick restarts. Players will be disqualified if save states are used for any other reason. The map must be completed within the time frame specified. And your playthrough must be streamed to either YouTube or Twitch and the VOD must be saved to your channel. Now this may sound daunting if you've never done it before, but this is extremely easy to set up with Streamlabs OBS or just OBS. This is just to ensure that each playthrough is valid. If you have any questions about setting up Streamlabs or setting up OBS to stream on YouTube or Twitch, there are some easy tutorials to follow on Streamlabs website. You don't need a very powerful computer and you just need a decent working internet to be able to stream these games that we will be playing. So don't let this deter you. It's an easy thing to learn, but don't let this scare you away. It's going to be a fun thing. And once you set this up once, you'll be able to do this in the future when we have more tournaments. Final basic rule, of course, is the lowest turn count will move on in the tournament, whether it be in the, the lowest turn counts in the qualifier or in each matchup in the bracket, the lowest turn count will move on. So in case of a tie, the win will go to those who had the fewest units die. And if there's still a tie at that point, the, the player that reports their turn total first will be the winner. So playing efficiently, as in low turns, is important, but also playing relatively quickly will help you get ahead of the competition. Qualifiers will be taking place on the following dates and times. March 1st, which is this Friday, at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. March 1st at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. March 2nd at 7 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. And finally, March 2nd at 5 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. Please sign up for all times you are available in the Google Form. You will be emailed the time of your qualifier. How will the qualifier work? A save file for a Fire Emblem game will be posted to the Fire Emblem Discussion LTC Tournament Discord. You will have two hours from the time the save is posted to complete your run, unless otherwise specified. Remember, your playthrough of the map must be streamed and saved to either YouTube or Twitch. Once you've finished the map, send me a PM on Discord with your email, the name of your YouTube or Twitch channel, which website you stream to, and the number of turns it took you to complete the map. So what game will we be playing? For the first ever tournament, we'll be playing a map selected from Fire Emblem The Sacred Stones. How much does it cost to enter the tournament? This first tournament is free. However, to help with cost of prizes in the future, there may be a small cost for participation. So what are the prizes? First place will get a pick between a copy of Fire Emblem Radiant Dawn, a $60 gift card to the Nintendo eShop, or a $60 gift card to GameStop. Second place will win a $30 gift card to the Nintendo eShop, or a $30 gift card to GameStop. And third place will win a $15 gift card to the Nintendo eShop, or a $15 gift card to GameStop. And finally, the most important question of all right now is how do you enter? 
Just go to the link below in the description and fill out the Google form. So I'm really excited about this. I hope you guys are too. So I'm really excited about this. I hope you guys are too. It's going to be a blast of a time. So please make sure to like and subscribe to keep up with the news on this tournament and future tournaments. The hope is that we'll be able to run it through the Fire Emblem Discussion YouTube channel as well as the Fire Emblem Discussion Discord effectively. So please stay tuned for news, updates, and I will also be featuring what I think are the most interesting or best playthroughs of each chapter that we play through. So please sign up. No matter the skill level, you're going to be able to play some Fire Emblem, have a good discussion with some friends, and it's going to be a good time.